Live from the WTXL studios, this is ABC 27's News at 5. Good evening, I'm Craig Angel. Thank you for watching WTXL ABC 27 News at 5.30. All month long, we here at WTXL have been recognizing the contributions of African Americans and celebrating Black History Month. Tonight, Florida leaders, including Governor Rick Scott, also paying tribute. WTXL's Rockman Johnson live for us right now at the Governor's Mansion to talk about a special exhibit going in place tonight. Good evening, Rockman. Hey, good evening. How are you? Thanks, Greg. And you know, not only is the governor honoring black history this month, black history is here in Florida. In fact, the lieutenant governor, Jennifer Carroll, is the first African-American female and female to be lieutenant governor here in Florida. And uh, there tonight, it's a celebration of Black History Month. It's here at the governor's mansion. And artist, the artist that will be featured for this show is Solomon Dixon. He's a South Carolina native who now calls Jacksonville home. And he says that his paintings are a reflection of cultural and spiritual awareness through his journey. Now, the reception honors Florida's long list of firsts when it comes to African-Americans. Of course, Jennifer Carroll, like I said earlier, the first lieutenant governor, Dr. Anna Girado, the first black man in the Senate, and there were a great deal of facts, other facts and first that the governor's presenting. Also, the governor tonight will, uh, to celebrate Black History Month, talk about an award that he'll present to educators as well as students. Now, if you want information about that award or any other information going on tonight, stop by our website, WTXL.TV. Live from the governor's mansion here in Midtown, I'm Rockman Johnson, ABC 27 News. Rockman, thank you very much. Chief Meteorologist.